Officially going to be uh, camera. We're not officially going to be starting quite yet. Um, what's it called? We've got about 15 or so minutes. That said, I am very, very in dire need of uh, well exercise, but that's a different thing. My back's giving me some issues. Um, what's it called? A warm up. So if you excuse me, I'll take this 10 or so minutes to just get going. Feel free to, uh, feel free to come in. how much I love Nora Jones. It's like one of those like artists that I've never really stopped listening to but forgot I stopped listening to them. It's peaceful actually. It's kind of nice. I'm away with me in the past. I'm away with me in the past. Sing like um, Nora Jones in karaoke. She is just an absolutely gorgeous. Um, like it's just so ill. La la. Come on. Oh, I almost forgot to put the. Mm -hmm. 
I need to change this because otherwise I'm just gonna keep singing along with her. Not with her, but with like with this. If the moon miss completely. Well, it's basically going through the entire Come Away With Me album. Which is nice, but also like, um, not what I need right now. Ah, uh, so much nostalgia. Alright, so, uh, so hopefully we can continue this fun trick of using Samson Flow and basically my wireless keyboard. Um, as like kind of a proxy between two different, uh, it's called both the computer and the, um, thingy right here. I'm actually tempted to put it like a little closer here so that it'll actually be closer to me instead of me having to look up. I think let me do that. Come with me on a journey. Ooh. Okay. It's kind of hilarious because I'm using a different camera literally on top of the HP camera that it comes with. Uh, only because it's slightly better, honestly, and because I can. Ooh. Man, this jazz is real funky. I like it, I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, it's real funky. Oh. Mm. Alright, um, we're gonna get started in about a minute. feeling it. Ooh, that's a good jazz. Ooh. Also, um, I'm keeping track also of the temperatures my computer is currently going through. Nothing's too much wrong with the SSD, uh, SSD card, but the core is getting a little hot. So I'm hoping that, um, I don't do too much to Annoy the thing, poor thing. Ooh, that is super funky. Holy crap. Ooh, funky. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pause this for a second while I get started with the Manga Drawing Lessons Online intro, as per usual. <laughs> right. Hello everyone, my name is Paolo Jossa, and I am the Dean Librarian here at the Govins branch of the Enoch Pratt Free Library. And today is yet another uh, edition of Manga Drawing Lessons Online. Um, learn how to draw anime and manga characters in bi-weekly online sessions. No prior drawing experience is needed. Supplies and resources for the program will be available at the Govins branch and online at that URL that should be right in front of you which should be, yes, it is in front of you. This is sister, this is a sister program. This is a sister program to the Manga Drawing Lessons in person. It should be upstairs uh, at the Govins branch since I'm currently downstairs in the um, basement. Um, join us in our twice monthly in-house programs every other Tuesday, uh, with the exception of like the last Tuesday and the Tuesday before that, oh, well, last Tuesday and Tuesday before that because of snow and other issues. Uh, 
<laughs> anyway, check out more Steam events at the Pratt. And um, if you're watching this in the future, um, or rather, if you're watching this like kind of like this week, I'd also like to put in a plug for our One Book Baltimore Discussions on Grief um, program that we're having this Monday, the February 6th, 5th? 6th. 6th. 6th? 5th. Hold on. I'm getting a calendar out. Uh, 5th. 5th. I was right. Ooh. Uh, January, uh, February 5th. Uh, 2024 uh, here at 3 p.m. There'll be light from light refreshments provided and we'll be talking about the major themes of like, grief and compassion and loss in the one book Baltimore. Uh, essentially, oh, and I'm saying this for the kids as well. If you want to come over and have a snack, you have to stay. OK, mm -hmm. you got to stay. Anyway. Last time we were here, we were basically continuing in our project of um, What's it called? Uh, what's it called? Of our mascot here, Edie. Basically, she looks like this. Um, or like this. Um, recently, but more recently, kind of looks like this. Um, I was hoping to put, oh, what's it called? Have her in like a superhero outfit. In, uh, uh, November, December, uh, November, December, but I couldn't get to that. So instead I was hoping to do it for January, February, and I couldn't get to that either. So with my new, new, um, what's it called? Not announcement, not, um, new, new deadline of February 1st. Um, I'll have to like do that then. So hopefully we'll be able to get that, get it done. Um, as a reminder, uh, we were basically basing, uh, uh, creating a, oh, no, this was, uh, there we go. Uh, we were basically basing, uh, her new costume on, um, spoiler from, on the DC series. Um, because I really like the coat and the cloak and the, um, other things. It's, oh yeah. And like this amazing, like leg, uh leg ammo pouch i guess it's kind of wild but i really like it anyway uh let's see if i can get this back Ooh. get us back on track with regards to the actual oh wait oh, hold on now i have to do some background work here for a moment uh so if you'd excuse me Let's get that open. Oh, yes, yes. Okay, this is what we've got so far. And switching keyboards again to transition over here. All right, so this is what we've got so far. Um, let's get some music in the background for now. Just like a, a light aperitif of the music. Uh, so to speak. I think I can... Oh, there we go. I can, like, kind of blast it a little bit on, like, your end. Um, at least on the recording end, and on the... Keep it down in here. And unfortunately, I've had to use, um, the... These things. Uh, instead of my usual like JLab airs because apparently if a computer has too many Bluetooth things connected to it it gets real wonky the sound gets real wonky and I don't want it to do that because I've connected the uh, keyboard here with this and this and you know done all that and I think um where did we leave off to hmm where did we leave off to actually that's a fair point um
Mm. Oh, skin. Yes. <clears throat> okay. So, first things first, we need to uh, pick up the color from the layer because I um, don't exactly know what the color is. Is it this color? Okay, it is this color. So, um, I don't know if you've noticed, but um, the right of the screen here in the eyedropper tool has two very important uh, settings in Clip Studio Paint. One is abstain, 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 obtain the display color, which means it color picks the color that you see on the screen. So when I do that and I pick this, it's obviously the flesh tone color. And this, it's like the darker multiplied version of that flesh tone color. However, because this is a multiply layer, I'm using it to, for shadows. What I'm going to do instead is click pick a color up from layer, very important distinction, and click it here and notice that it becomes like the color of the shading, multiply shading that we're using. And more so, if I put it here, it'll be nothing. Notice the nothing here. Um, because um, I'll be taking, I'm not, that's not actually a color that I'm picking because it's just the shading, which is out, um, because there's nothing being shaded there. So I'll be taking this color and continuing um, like my coloring, which I believe was a pen. Definitely, oh yeah, this it's a bit very specific um, oil pen. Yep, there we go. Nice, nice, more flesh. Yeah, I think I was kind of using it, using it very lightly. Add more contrast to all the bits, but not too much contrast to the bits. I want there to be some sort of Like a gradient. There we go. Nice. Okay. Uh, I honestly don't know where the light is coming from, and at this point, I'm too afraid to ask. <laughs> All right. So that is the flesh. We're going. To, ooh. Oh, oh, that's so weird. Look, if I take off the eye mask, this is what's behind it. Oh, oh, that's so weird. Oh, 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 yeah, you don't like it. Kind of like they took a chunk out from her face and her eyes. Ooh, 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 do not like that. I do not like that. Oh boy, that's not fun. Oh, let's look at it again though. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, the hair is even worse. Oh god, it's so funny looking. Okay, focus. <laughs> okay, we're going to put in another. Oops. We're gonna put in another layer. Clip it over the eye mask bit, and add. Uh, put it to multiply and create some more shadows using the same brush and the same technique. Um, I'm just going to need to go real close. I like that. Uh, the next one will be the hair. Stop doing that. Okay. So the hair is going to be a little tricky. And I think we're going to need to go a little small on it. Oh, oh no. We need to go a little small on it. Because we're basically highlighting... Uh, her, uh...
I think we're going to need to be a little deliberately heavy-handed in how we do this. Oh, kind of blasted out in the back like that. Oops. Such a small detail you won't notice. Save it before it gets deleted, because that's always an issue. Always something scary.
okay genuinely this is a bit of too much of a bop uh it's kind of <laughs> it's kind of uh, distracting let me see if i can switch to something a little calmer Something calm, come on. There we go. Right, let's put on some lo fi. Okay, there we go. Um, just for the folks at home, um, I did put this on black um, so that I can see if I have literally and literally, oh, quite literally and figuratively, missed the spot. So hopefully we can like figure that out as we go along. Maybe that's the hair. That's a face mask. Oh, that's the face mask. Okay. Uh, let's add. Let's start with a face mask. Oops. Why? Oh, Lord. There we go. That's enough. Gives it a little bit more. Leaves. Beat the process. Beat. Oop. Ah. 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 Wait, what happened? Where's my brush? There we go. Is it just the sleeves? Oh, it's also the shoes. Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. Please do not cut. What else? Maybe a little garter belt type thing here. I have to make that a little bigger. Get the effect I'm going for. Yeah, nope, stop. Uh, my large fingies.
pieces. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Oh my god. Um, <laughs> I put the thing of just saying, like, oh, my coconut doggy. And that's like, that's the best, like, way to describe a capybara I've ever heard. That's so funny. I, I kind of love it. Um, oh, god, that's funny. Okay. Mm. Sorry, I just need to disassociate for a moment so that I can concentrate back on the thing. Um. <laughs> Having ADHD is weird. I don't recommend it. Kids, I don't recommend it. Good God, where was I? Leaves and shoes. Okay, cool. Uh, next one is the gloves. Um, let's see. Something as before. Normal multiply. And then. Okay. Huh? What? I, ouch! Lola. Okay, might need to put in a fine tooth brush for this one. Um, and then, um, uh, a large, to just show, you know, Uh, yeah. Okay. 
then smaller one you just go through the fine fine detail then erase that fine detail Looking good. Trust the process. Please trust the process. Trust the process. Trust huh. the process. I feel kind of bad. I genuinely haven't touched my, um, my, like, larger uh, graphics tablet back home because I've just been so busy trying to survive I hate capitalism so much i just want to sit down and draw all day but i can't i gotta work On one hand, I almost don't want to add any more details because it'd be it'd be a lot more work. <laughs> I think she's done though. Um, hmm. yeah, I'm just gonna like keep looking at it while eating like a thing of chocolate. Um, uh, let's change the background. See what she looks like on white. Looks good, looks good. I don't know what I was going for, but I kind of like it now. It really is like the trust the process type thing. She needs highlights, though. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. 
I think she needs more detail. That's what she needs. Um. Mm. She looks fine as is. I most want to send it off to the printers because I just want this to be done. So I can move on to the next thing. And yet. If I put this like underneath everything, and then Ridiculous Gaussian blur on it or something. Okay, now I'm just playing with it at this point. Um, duplicate layer.
Okay. I see. No, oh, there's got to be, um, there's got to be a way to, um, mm, there it is, line, there we go. That uh, 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 there we go. Hmm. 
Mm. Oh. There it is. Hmm. If I add like a couple bit more glow. Oh, hold on. Oh, oops. Too much.
This one should be 20. This one should be like 10. Okay, that's cool as hell though. I like that. Okay. So, it seems to be working just fine. Sorry for the delay. I was just playing with the outline version of that and just like moving stuff back and forth I'm definitely gonna have to put them on a bar dark bark background dark background of some sort maybe just like um like a city scene or like some sort of something but i think i'm gonna have to call this a day here ish because we've been going for almost an hour and unfortunately i do have my other Uh, what's it called other things to f other obligations to fill. Uh, yeah, that's cool. She needs room lighting. That's what she needs. He needs a touch of...
<sighs> hmm. Fun. Not perfect. We still need to do highlights and actual highlights and stuff. But for now, I think this will be a good place to stop. Anyway. Um, thanks for watching. Um, again, this has been Mango Drawing Lessons Weekly, uh, here at the Govins branch of the Enoch Pratt Free Library. This has been Paolo Jossa, um, your, uh, what's it called? Your teen librarian here at the Govins branch, letting you know that we'll be having this, uh, hopefully more often than not. Um, I really do enjoy doing this sort of stream. Um, yeah, period. Um, we'll see you again soon, alright? Later days.